would like to show you how to make this bracelet. This is my own little design and it will please those who like narrow and tight patterns. This is really narrow, it's only about one centimeter wide. It is a very simple two-step pattern and you can either make two steps in one color and two steps in the other color and always alternating these two colors or you can make one step in one color and second step in another color and alternate the steps. Today I will be showing you how to make this one. It's made of metallic silver and neon purple pens. I wanted to make a drawing for you but then I realized it's just so simple it's it would be useless. So let's get started. So first thing is a cup end made of metallic silver. <clears throat> then we take purple and pull it through the cup end and reattach. And now we need to add one and one bend on each side so that we end up with six on our hook. And we will use the classical way how to do that. Remove the first bend, reattach one half of the cup bend and close it off. Then you take another silver, pull it through the first two and pick up the purple and then close it off. So here we have the first three loops and then we just go to the other side and do the same on the opposite side. Remove the first band, reattach the cup end, close it off and then you take your next silver to keep the order so you unlock these two but you need to keep the order so the purple is the first then the silver is the second then you just reclaim the purple and close it off like so if you pull the car band the bands will fall into the right position and you will have three and three bands on each side of your hook. And now the first thing is we need to do some braiding. And we take these first three bands and we will pull this one over the second and pull the third over the second in the middle and you put your finger in here and you hold it separated because now we are going to to break these two loops only you take your silver you pull it through those two bands reattach the first one and close it off this band is going to be quite loose at this stage but it doesn't matter you just pull it a little bit over here so that it sticks out like this and let it be now push it to the other side and we are going to do the same we take the first three loops and we need to braid them so you take the first one pull it over the middle band and then you take third one and pull it over the middle again. You put your finger over here to keep them separated. You take your silver, pull it through the both bands and reattach the purple one and close it off. And again pull this end of the new band a little bit out. So you should have something like this. 
And now you take your purple band and you are going to pull it through all eight loops. So put it on your hook and just pull it through carefully like so. If you stretch it out like this you can see these four silver loops sticking out. So from the right side it is the first and the third and then it is the sixth and the eighth band. And these are the bands we are going to pick up. So you just turn your hook around like this, it's easier, and pick up the first, the third, you skip the fourth and the fifth, but you pick up the sixth and the eighth band and you close it off. Like so. So this is the entire sequence and you will just repeat the same over and over again. So we're going to do the first line again. We need to do some braiding on this first three bands, first three loops, but this one is already in the right position. You see, if you unbraid them, it looks like this. So you need to put this one between the other two and then you take the third one and put it back between these two. You hold your finger over there and take your silver, pull it through, just take care that the bands don't switch places. You reattach or pick up the purple one and close it off. And again don't forget to pull this out a little bit and go to the other side to do the exact same steps. Here are the three loops we are going to work with. Take the first one, pull it over between the other two and then take the last one and pull it over here. Hold your fingers over there, use metallic silver pull it through like so and then just reattach the purple and close it off pull it a little bit like so then you take the purple one and pull it through all eight loops and you reattach those four that are sticking out this, 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 and this, and close it off. And that's it. You have done two sequences. And you just go over and over until your bracelet is long enough to close it. You can close it very easily because this pattern is very simple. So you just take one silver band, pull it through all six loops, and you can maybe put bead on it like I did. If you can see over here, I have put glass beads to tighten this band and to fix, fix the braid in this position. And then I just put a C-clip over there. So here it is, the Marnelli bracelet. I hope you like my little tutorial and I will be very happy if you tag me to your renditions to let me see your work. Thank you very much. Goodbye.